Welcome back to Keep Up News Channel. Mike Tyson is renowned for his brutal power, while Jake Paul's work ethic is viewed as his greatest strength, but what did their opponents really think after fighting them? For any boxer, facing Mike Tyson in the ring is an experience few forget, especially when it comes to his punch power. His opponents have consistently described the impact of Tyson's blows as something beyond the norm for even elite fighters. Roy Jones Jr., who fought Tyson in an exhibition bout in 2020, said it felt like being kicked by a mule and considered Tyson, despite his age, as the hardest puncher he had ever encountered. Tyson's blows are famed for their unique combination of speed and brute force, which even the most prepared fighters find overwhelming. Many former opponents credited Tyson with having the ability to end fights in seconds if he connected cleanly. Comparatively, Jake Paul's punches, while powerful, are a different story. Known for his work ethic and improving skill set, Paul is strong but has yet to achieve anywhere near the terrifying power Tyson possessed in his prime. MMA fighter Tyron Woodley, who faced Paul twice, noted Paul's physicality but didn't describe his power as exceptional. Woodley instead highlighted Paul's accuracy and conditioning, which have enabled him to score knockouts against fighters transitioning from MMA. Nate Diaz, another opponent, acknowledged the YouTuber-turned-boxer's power but saw it more as a calculated and steady force than a raw powerhouse in the Tyson mold. As Tyson and Paul get set to do battle in the early hours of Saturday morning, GMT, this difference in reputation for punching power sets up a stark contrast. Tyson's punches are infamous in boxing lore for their knockout potential, while Paul's strength has yet to reach such mythical status. So, with the above in mind, Male Sport has taken a look at what some of Tyson and Paul's former opponents have said about their power. Mike Tyson's former opponents Larry Holmes Larry Holmes, a former heavyweight champion himself, was known for his durability and skill but Tyson's power left him visibly shaken and ultimately led to a knockout. Speaking about Tyson, Holmes said, He hit me harder than anyone has ever hit me in my life. He punched me with everything. Michael Spinks Michael Spinks, an undefeated champion before facing Tyson, famously lasted only 91 seconds in the ring. Tyson's overwhelming power in the opening seconds shocked Spinks and spectators alike. Speaking about Tyson, Spinks said, that man could punch. I tried to avoid getting hit by him, but once he hit me, I was done. Lennox Lewis Lennox Lewis, another heavyweight legend, defeated Iron Mike later in Tyson's career. However, he always respected Tyson's power and often commented on the danger of being caught by one of Tyson's punches. Speaking about Tyson, the former undisputed heavyweight champion said, Mike was an animal. You knew that if he connected, it was lights out. Frank Bruno Frank Bruno fought Tyson twice and suffered knockouts both times. He often spoke about Tyson's intimidating power, calling him a monster in the ring. Speaking about Tyson, Bruno said, He hits so hard, it's unreal. You don't know where you are when he catches you. Evander Holyfield Evander Holyfield's durability and tactical skills helped him beat Tyson twice but he respected Tyson's raw power and athleticism, referring to him as one of the hardest hitters he ever faced. Speaking about Tyson, Holyfield said, he had the power to knock you out at any moment. He was like a dynamite stick waiting to explode. Trevor Burbick Trevor Burbick lost his heavyweight title to Tyson and was left stumbling and disoriented after a brutal second-round knockout. He famously struggled to stand up after being knocked down showing how Tyson's power left him unable to regain balance. Speaking about Tyson, Burbick said, I didn't know where I was when he hit me. His punches feel like sledgehammers. Buster Douglas Buster Douglas famously beat Tyson in one of the biggest upsets in boxing history, but he still commented that Tyson's power was unlike anything else he'd encountered. Speaking about Tyson after their fight, Douglas said, He hit harder than anyone else I faced. It was like a bomb going off. Kevin McBride Kevin McBride fought Tyson in his final professional bout, until now, and later remarked on the danger posed by Tyson's still formidable power, even past his prime. Speaking about Tyson, McBride said, even when he was older, he had that power. 
one punch could end your career. Tony Tucker Tony Tucker managed to go the distance with Tyson, but he left the ring with a fractured hand and spoke repeatedly about Tyson's unbelievable power. Speaking about Tyson after their fight, Tucker said, he was an absolute powerhouse, like nothing I'd ever felt. Jake Paul's former opponents. Anderson Silva Anderson Silva, one of the most respected MMA fighters of all time, praised Paul's power after their fight. While Silva's striking experience is vast, he admitted that Paul's punches were heavier than he expected. Speaking about Paul, Silva said, he hits hard. People may think he's just a YouTuber, but he's a real fighter. Nate Diaz Nate Diaz went the distance with Paul, but downplayed Paul's power, attributing it to his own durability. However, he still recognized that the YouTuber-turned-boxer could land some solid shots. Speaking about Paul after the fight took place, Diaz said, He's got some pop, but I'm not going down from just that, before he also added, He's a decent boxer, I'll give him that. Tommy Fury Tommy Fury, an undefeated professional boxer, handed Paul his first loss. He acknowledged Paul's strength, but argued that Paul was still inexperienced as a boxer, citing moments where he outboxed him with technical skill. Speaking about Paul after their fight, Fury said, he's strong, no question. But not unstoppable. Deji Deji, who fought Paul in Paul's amateur debut, mentioned that while he didn't feel the same level of power as other pro fighters, Paul's strength was notable for someone with no previous fight experience. Speaking about Paul, Deji said, he's got a decent punch, you can feel it. Tyrone Woodley Tyrone Woodley, a former UFC champion, faced Paul twice and was knocked out in their rematch. Although initially skeptical, he acknowledged Paul's punching power as he said, he's better than I thought. Speaking out Paul, he added, he's got power, that's for sure. He caught me clean. Source, dailymail.co.uk Please like share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.